Hey YouTube, it's Audrey, and I wanted to share with you the items I received back from the swap that I was in. The Teeny Tiny Book Charm Swap, which was hosted by Tamika, who is Scrap the World here on YouTube. We were in groups of six, and I was in the first group. I became an angel um, for someone who could not um, fulfill their um, spot in the group. So um, I ended up with the Clean and Simple Group 1. So, I will show you the items in their packaging, and then I will come back and show it to you um, outside the package, what the charms actually look like. First up, there's Tanya Himes, and I'm not sure if that's her YouTube name or not, but um, she has nicely packaged hers here in this cute little chevron um, and clear bag, and then she has matching papers and trim as a topper and then a flower so that's that one next up is Tamika herself she was actually in this group and Tamika <laughs> she could have just left me one because she worked on it when she was at my house um so she was doing the books then little did we know that I actually end up in the group with her but anyway um she has packaged hers in um, glassine or parchment paper bags that she has um, pinked the edges. And then she has like a paper trim that's white, a lace trim that's pink, and then flat back pearls, two roses, a cute little tag, um, I believe from the Michaels bin that says hello, and then um, lace trimming. So that's the back of hers and then she also had her goodies included um, outside the package so um, she gave us different kinds of trims and beads and some rosettes so love that thank you girl next up is Jessica who's mama JT4 and she has used colorful colorful paper to make a folder to put hers in and then she has put it in a bag and tied it up with um steam bonnet. next we have natalie who's put some bling on it and natalie made us a great big pinwheel it's so cute and it says hello sunshine and then that's the back and um that's natalie's card really cute and then last is Chi Town Tracy. And um, she looks like she has embossed some glassing bags with the chevron pattern. Hopefully, you could see that. And she also used a tag, I think, out of the Michaels bin that says Thinking of You. It's a cute foam rose and seen by the ribbon that is clipped on with a clothespin. And then Tracy did a cute little card. Her, she put her card in, um, made a shaker card out of it. So that's really cute. So that's the packaging. And normally, folks, I don't usually take my things out of the package. But I am going to do it this time. So I'll be back in a second with everything out to show you. Okay, everybody, I am back with everything out of the packaging. So, first up, here's Tanya's. Um, she did a cute corrugated um, mason jar. And her charm features a, um, like a glass tile with a little bitty tiny gorgeous girl image under it. And a doily and a cute little bitty rose. And then... Um, some bling on the back and then she has these cute charms that are different color beads and then a clear time very very cute and she has her information on the back and then she included these cute little trims that are on a cork tag and then she has little bitty tiny flowers let me see those 
Thank you so much, Tanya. I love it. That's really cute. Next, Tamika. And she presented hers in this little box that she made. So, since I'm using one hand, I took it, everything out of the packaging. But this is Tamika's. And she did a um, stickled rose. And she has a little bit of lace trim on the book. And then she has these cute little charms. There is a pink bead, a dragonfly, and a bird. And then she also has bling down the edge. Really like it, Tamika. She tried to be as clean and simple as possible. She went a little to the shabby side, but not too much. <laughs> I had to give her a hard time because um, Tamika is really trying to do things that are, you know, outside of her shabby comfort zone. So I'm really proud of her. Um, this one is um, Jessica, who's Mama J T4, and she had hers in this envelope that was covered with the colorful paper and this um, flower. And she used the same kind of pastel paper as um, her background that she has on the top of her thing. And then um, hers is really cute too. It's the pastel colors with this little bow and then she has some lace trim also. And then her charms are a flower and then this iridescent bead and a pearl. Really, really, really cute. And she um, is the only one in the group who actually used silver chain. Everybody else, it seems, in our group went with gold. I think I put a black chain on mine, though. But um, I like the way hers turned out also. Thank you, Jessica. Here's Natalie, and Natalie had packaged hers in um, a little clear bag, but I took it out so you could see it. And Natalie has a fuchsia flower with a little pearl center. She's added little stickles on there, and then there looks like there is an applique behind it. That's the paper on the back. And then she has lots and lots of cute charms here. Um, she has a butterfly. Sorry. I'm trying to show it to you up close and make it focus. So the stuff in the background, it doesn't want to focus as much. But um, she has clear and pink beads and like a milk glass white bead and green beads. And these are really, really, really cute. And then Natalie included some beautiful lace trim and then some flower sequins. There's some green ones and then some pink ones. So thank you so much, Natalie. I love that. And I love your charm also. Very, very cute. And then lastly, we have Tracy, who is Chi-Town Tracy. And she packaged hers in a shaker bag. She had a little shaker frame um, with like um, crepe paper around it as like a rosette, a little butterfly and a bow. And as you can see, there are sequins in there. So really, really cute. And it is a coin envelope. So that's how her charm came. And this is her charm. Also uh, cute. Floral paper. She has a bow to tie hers. And a little flower. And then that's the back. And then she has um, a star charm. A cute, cute, cute bee cat with a pink bee there. And then she has... Sorry little glitter pink heart there 
And then this little heart that says made with love. Very cute. And then she included these two cute little felt. There's a macaroon and I don't know if this is a marshmallow or what that is. But it's really cute. So she included that. And she also included some cute purple and lavender trim. So that's what I received from... Um, thank you, Tracy. I'm sorry. I was going ahead of myself. But um, I really like all of the ones that I got. They are all so cute. And um, I really appreciate, ladies, everything that you've made. Your packaging, your gifts, and the charms. And uh, at least this time, I actually took things out of the package. Because usually, when I'm in a swap, I, I don't use the stuff. I just love to have things that other people have made. And I keep them in my collection. And every so often, I pull them out and look at them. <laughs> So, I'm at least going to say I'm going to try and start using the goodies that you see. <laughs> because I just have not, for the most part, used it. But I'm going to try and get better because I know that's what you send us that stuff for is to use it. So, I thank you. I appreciate it. And you have a great and very blessed day. Bye-bye.